bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the red corner from Manchester, England, and standing at six feet nine inches, here is a sensational heavyweight champion of the world, the Gypsy King, Tyson Fury. Fighting out of the blue corner, introducing the big heavyweight undefeated in his campaign with a record of eight wins, no losses, with seven wins coming by way of knockout. At just 20 years of age, here is the young, undefeated, heavyweight hopeful known as the Gypsy King, introducing Tyson Fury. The fans are ready, and it looks like the fighters are now ready. I'm so giddy, so excited. The anticipation is second to none. Let's get it on. These two have certainly talked the talk. Now they've got to walk the walk. Good luck. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. His jab just got blocked. Oh, and he caught him with a stiff jab. What a pleasure it is to be here in this environment. What a venue for this showdown. You have some fighters that are big show, big arena fighters, and they bask in this, they love this, they are born for this. You have other fighters where this will be like the rabbit in the headlights. Punch, counter punch. One moment changes everything, especially in this division. I can't believe we're only halfway through the round. The straight right just misses. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Every time they throw a shot, they get countered. Every time they drop their guard, they get caught. When you're fighting a counter puncher, the feint can be such a good weapon. Pretend you're gonna punch, make the counter puncher throw a punch, and then you counter them. Reaction is second to none. It's the blink of an eye, and they're waiting for any little twitch you do. So you've got to fight a counter puncher smart. <laughs> Cannot throw out a lazy jab in this fight. You'll get knocked out. You know the scorecards are gonna be all over the place in this one. Beautiful counter shot. There's a counter shot. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. Well, we know they've got the advantage so far, but how does this match get turned around? I seriously hope the judges kept their eye on this fight because if they haven't, there's gonna be absolute uproar. Big deep breaths, big deep friend. Get out there and switch on. Get this box. Switch on, switch on. You've been... They ring the bell and here we go. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Jab misses. That jab doesn't score. This fighter's completely content to sit back and let you make the first move. That's where they thrive. Todd, I understand what you're saying, but you've got to be on this. You've got to be on it. You've got to be a pro. You've got to think right. Concentrate. Halfway through the round, and man, these two are going at it. Needs to put some combination work together. One punch is good, two punch is better. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill, tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you, and so I've got to respect both of them. More than happy. Oh, 
Both men step back for just a moment. Got to let your hands go a little bit. It's okay to be aggressive now. The right hook just missed. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. How about that time counter shot? Let's talk about Fury in that last round. Well, we're entering desperation mode here. Gonna need a knockout. Wow, you know what? I've been in fights like that. When you think you come up, bell, ring away. You walk back to the corner like you've just seen the sun. I need you to focus on what's there and win this round. And there's the bell to start the round. Well, they got battered last round. How do they turn their fortunes around? This is one of those situations. You've just been hurt. You've got to get out there again. Be smart. Be sharp. Don't be a fool. Don't get suckered in. Make him fight your fight. Hold him, tie him up just until your head clears again and your legs come back again. Because if you don't, he's going to pop you off. As it is in most heavyweight fights, don't blink because one big shot and this thing could be over. Do you believe this? That's it. Don't forget your body. Mix it up. Mix it up. Body and head. You'd like to see more jabs. <laughs> A very competitive round here so far. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. A very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. This is the heavyweight division. One punch could end this fight. Todd, you know what? Sometimes when I've got in the ring with fights like that and you punch them, you just want to run. You want that spaceship to come and lift you out of there because you think, what the hell am I going to do now? This is one of the best rounds I've seen this year. Very close round with 10 seconds. Tyson Fury just got buzzed. His eyes don't look good. Body language is bad. He could go down. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. What would you tell this guy? He's got to do something different. Every second, every minute of this fight is important. Every second, every minute of this round is important. You cannot afford to lose it. Look at him, that breath, bang him downstairs. Jab him downstairs, stop him. Don't let him get back into the fight. Don't let him get that confidence. He's going to be stressing out. Important now in this first minute, this next round, that you get on top of him, keep him busy with the jab, work him behind the jab, and then let his shots go. Don't let him get back. And there's the bell to start the round. So the fight will continue. How do they turn things around? That was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet, not until your senses have come back. When are we going to see a jab from these two? Well, Johnny, I know it's still early on, but have you been surprised by anything you've seen? Don't get trigger happy, because all of a sudden you're going to be gassing yourself out trying to get that shot, and that's when they catch you. Beautiful counter shot. Not a lot of defense here at all. Tough to be a judge in this fight as both fighters have had their big moments. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there would be uh, some more action here. Okay, so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Not 
had a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. <sighs> Gotta let your hands go a little bit. It's okay to be aggressive now. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. Punch, counter punch. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. They've got the momentum, they've got the advantage. How do they carry that into the next round? As long as they don't get complacent, you think this is too easy. If they keep this same kind of pace up, they've got this fight. He's knackered. Don't let that air. And every time you see him take a big deep breath, bang him downstairs. They ring the bell, and here we go. After a really strong round, let's see if they can finish the job. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. There's nothing quite like a big heavyweight fight. Everything can change with one punch. This is when you get in the ring feeling like you're King Kong because you know you've got a chin that is not going to get dented. Right when you think the pace will slow down, it picks up. Well done with that counter shot. A perfect counter shot. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. You'd like to see more jabs. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Top. And Tyson Fury just got clipped. The big fella might be in big trouble. I thought we were going to see the finish there. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. Completely gone. I thought there's no way he's going to finish this round. But look at that. Oh, and Tyson Fury just got rocked. This could be it. Tyson. And down goes Fury. I don't think we can truly appreciate what we saw unless we see it in slow motion. Where did that come from? What a shot. One, two, three, four. Can you continue? So we enter the final 10 seconds here in a pretty dominant display. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. What a huge momentum swing that's going to be considering that round will be 10-8 after the knockdown. I love the response though. Got back up, took a deep breath and thought, right, brush it off, get on with the job. Look at him now. Don't let him get back in at this fight. Come on, you've got this. Don't, don't let him get back into the fight. Don't let him get that confidence. He's going to be stressing out his guy. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. His eyes look pretty clear here, Johnny. How do you think he's going to do after being knocked down in the last round? What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They staggered back to the corner. They've got to freshen them up, alert them again, get them back on point again. This round, they've got to coast around. Don't get involved. Give yourself another three minutes to get your head clear. Both men step back for just a moment. I think it's safe to say one of these fighters certainly has a significant speed advantage. You can tell who it is. Some fighters are just gifted. Gifted with such hand speed, footwork, movement. They are gifted. They are the chosen few. Well done with that counter shot. You don't want to trade shots. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there would be uh, some more action here. As we enter the final frames of this bout, Johnny, what have we seen so far? 
This could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know somebody's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, it can be intimidating. Just depends on how confident you are as a fighter. When are we going to see a jab from these two? Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. After what we saw in that last round, it's pretty obvious who has the advantage here. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's up to you as the fighter, and the cornerman's got to put a firecracker on that fighter. Get out there and get the... They ring the bell, and here we go. Well, Johnny, can he keep the momentum going after that last huge round for him? Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. <laughs> no rest for the weary. <laughs> nice counter shot. They're both looking for the knockouts here, and that's what we expect from heavyweights. Sometimes when you get in there with someone that's so powerful, you've got to think them. You just don't be smarter than them. You've got to be like a little fag and pickpocket them. They better start respecting each other's punching power. We're at the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. Still could go either way. The straight right just misses. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other, because no one's there to do anything out of turn. Well done with that counter shot. Big hook. Good thing it didn't land. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Those counter punches have to hurt. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. Tyson Fury just got rocked. Do you believe this? Let's talk about Fury in that last round. That bell could not have come soon enough for this guy. The bell, sometimes it couldn't be the sweetest sound. Nate's ease shattered. Come on, look across at him. Look at him now. Great. Bang him downstairs. Jab him downstairs. Stop him. Don't let him get back into the fight. Don't let him get that confidence. He's going to be stretching out. Important now in this first minute, this next round, that you get on top of him, keep him busy with the jab, work him behind the jab, and then let your shots go. Don't let him get back in at this fight. Come on, you getting that breath in. Don't let him get back into this fight. The fight. Don't let him get that confidence. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. That corner has got to find a way to get some momentum behind their fighter. They've had one minute to recover. Now they've got to bluff it. They've got to bluff it. They've got to come out now and style it out. Get on the back foot. Jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then put the pressure on. Well, Johnny, it's still early on, but what do you think about what we're seeing so far? This can be so frustrating. When you remember such a fast fighter, a fast fighter that can throw three, four shot combinations before you've even let one off. That creates frustration, and that's when it gets hard. This is a high octane battle. Needs to put some combination work together. One punch is good, two punch is better. Down goes Fury! Wow, that impact was incredible. Let's take another look at it. That's lights out right there.
Well, they're back up now, but they've got to be cautious. Cannot afford to trade back now, can they, Johnny? Some fighters, when this happens, this can be heartbreaking. Some fighters, it makes them angry. They want to get back into the mix again. I want to know, what sort of character are we looking at here? You'd like to see more jabs. Final 10 seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. Perfect counter shot. So it's plan B time after being knocked down in that round. You've been put down, you've got to think right, survive, and then give it back the next round. Now in his first minute, look at him. He's absolutely knackered, mate. He's knackered. Just kick him behind the jab and then let his shots go. Don't let him get back in it. Confidence. He's going to be stretching out his gas tank now. Keep whacking him to the body. Get back into the fight. Don't let him get that confidence. He's going to be stretching about his gas tank now. Keep whacking him to the body. Keep taking away that air. And every time you see him take a big deep breath, bang him down. So this fight is so important now that in the first minute of this next round, don't let him get back into this fight. It's so important now. And then let your shots go. Don't let him get back into this fight. Come on, you got this. Working behind the jab and then let your shots go. Don't let him get back in, back into the fight. Don't let him get that confidence. He's going to be... Time winding down as we get set for another round. Don't let him get that confidence. He's going to be stressing... Every time you see him get a big deep breath, bang him downstairs, jab him downstairs. And there's the bell to start the round. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. Todd, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round coming out? He's getting everything, everything full battle because I know his legs are gone. So this, you watch what's going to happen. If he doesn't, I'll be very, very surprised. Well, Johnny, we're in the early stages here. What have you seen so far? What can they change? Can they slow the pace down? Can they hope to, to, to knock them out early? What can they do? They've got to concentrate and relax. Because you know what you can do in the gym. You can do it in a fight. They've got to relax. That hook just can't find the target. Nice defense on that hook. Real good back and forth between these two fighters. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Every time he throws a punch, a receipt is coming right back. You can tell who's stronger and who's faster. Fury in serious trouble. I don't see how he's going to get out of this. Looks like they're out of trouble. Got caught sleeping on the job. What do you do? You step back. Steady yourself. Recompose yourself. Then boom. Back into it. But do not make those mistakes. This the wrong. And Tyson Fury just got clipped. The big fella might be in big trouble. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Perfect counter shot. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. And a round that seemed like eternity for them finally comes to a close. Needs a knockout without a doubt. Needs to go out there and think, right, you know what? Next round, you're getting it. You're getting it. Kitchen sink. Look at him now. Don't let him get back in at this fight. Come on, you've got this. Don't. It's so important now that in the first minute of this next round, you get on top of the confidence. He's going to be stressing about his gas tank now. Keep whacking him to the body, keep taking away that air, and every time you see him take a big deep breath, bang him downstairs. Jab him downstairs. Don't let him get back into the fight. Don't let him get that confidence he's going to be satisfied. It's so important now in this first minute, this next round, they're taking away that air. Every time you see him get a big deep breath, bang him down. Got to go. Don't let him get back in at this fight. Come on, you've got this. Don't, Don't let him get back into this fight. It's so and that'll do it for the minute break as we get set to get back in the action. Keep whacking. Working behind the jab and then let your shots go. Don't let him get back into this fight. Come on, you got... They ring the bell and here we go. After that last round, something has got to change. Now he knows he's been hurt. He's going to come out and put the pressure on. He's going to throw the kitchen sink at you. You've got to be ready for that. Don't fight fire with fire. 
Hold him off. Be smart because he's going to try and put you under pressure. He knows your legs have gone. He knows your head's not cleared. Be sharp. They hit like heavyweights, but they move like middleweights. Truly elite level stuff here. You've got to be courageous when you get in there with someone that's bigger, stronger, and faster. You've just got to use brain then. Beautiful counter shot. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. These two are the perfect dance partners. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. Catch and shoot. And he wasn't ready for that counter punch. Hook misses. Well, Johnny, has anything surprised you here as we enter the final frame of this bout? Now this is about desire. This is about character. This is about what? Oh, and Tyson Fury just got rocked. This could be it. Tyson Fury, one of the great heavyweight champions. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds. Tyson Fury just got buzzed. Down goes Fury. Thank goodness we've got instant replay. We get to see it again. I've got to see that again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Listen to me. Are you okay? Let's talk about Fury in that last round. Let's see how the game plan changes after that big knockdown. Can make or break a fighter. Get your boxing back together. Listen, Pete. What you doing? You switched off completely. The fight's not over yet. You jab and breathe when you're stepping around. But you've let him back into it. Get your mind back on the job. That's a tactic. You're better than this, kid. Go back out there and win the round. Get back behind your jab. Basics. Just get your rhythm back, and then we go again. Don't worry about that round. Bound. I need you to get back out there. I need you to win this round. Forget about that round. It was a bad round, but we don't care. Just box him. Be smart. Just get your shots off. Don't give him anything. Get out there. I need you to win this round. Get your mind back. Get your focus back. But you've lost. Don't worry about it. Time winding down as we get set to jump back in the action. Give him anything. Go back and win the bad round, all right? But we don't care. Go out there and win this next round. And there's the bell to start the round. Got to get the momentum shift coming their way. What can they do here? What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation. It's how you are going to deal with this. Tyson Fury in serious trouble. I don't see how he's going to get out of this. As he survived the storm, he's throwing punches again. Defense, defense, defense. Tyson Fury just got rocked. Do you believe this? He had his moment, but has it gone by? Three days now needs to... And, and down goes Fury. Lincoln, you miss it. Good thing we can watch that all over again. A shot from the gods took him out. Not many people would have predicted it, but we've got a knockout victory. Oh, what a shot. What a shot. You see shots like that in the gym. At least for once, this is on TV. Thousands around the world saw that shot. They probably even heard it.